We are joined now by a familiar face to Western New Yorkers. He is the former special agent in charge of the Buffalo FBI. Bernie Tolbert is joining us now. Bernie, nice to see you. See you too. Thank you for having me on. And thanks for joining us on the 530. We got the good news that it wasn't terrorism, that the governor said it was a horrific accident. What was happening uh, between after they this accident happened up until now? How did they come to this conclusion? Well, first thing they're going to want to do is, is make sure that that people are safe. So you're going to want to secure the area, make sure that there's no potential uh, a, a potential threat coming, a, a second attack or a third attack, if indeed it was an attack. So you're going to want to do that first. And then you're going to start gathering as much intelligence as you can, uh, analyzing uh, forensic evidence at the scene, but also you're going to want to start talking to sources. Uh, the law enforcement have their sources that they're going to want to reach out to see if they, anyone has any inkling of this, if there's been any chatter, uh, discussion that, you know, we, that can, they can start to use to piece together exactly what went on. You mentioned uh, sources and chatter, and that's something that I think a lot of people tend to think that they can dismiss things online outright, but that really is a tool that the FBI and other agencies use to determine uh, whether or not there is a threat or an imminent threat. Absolutely, uh, you know, as a law, as a former law enforcement official, one of the things uh, you, you like to think that you're very good at what you do, but I always say that no matter how good law enforcement is, it's oftentimes it's someone giving them a little nugget, a little clue that puts them on the right trail. They may not solve it for them, but there's a little bit of information that leads law enforcement towards where they need to go. So yeah, I think it's important to check with your human sources, to check with uh, uh, other kinds of sources, uh, online, social media, see who's saying what, and anything that you can glean that might help you to start to piece together where things are and what's going on, it's going to be useful to law enforcement. Bernie Tolbert, former FBI special agent in charge, thank you so much for joining us on the 530. We appreciate it. You're welcome. Have a good Thanksgiving. Thank, thank you. It, it's interesting, isn't it? To it really hear, is. you know, all the small tactics or things that, you know, you would mm -hmm. think were pretty pedestrian that we would overlook. Uh, but they the don't. FBI does not. No, they follow up on every lead. Right now,